Welcome to the bus life. Right now what I'm working on is putting our brick. We've got these real clay bricks. They're thin, mm -hmm. very pretty light. Um, and this is where our little wood stove is gonna go. I know some of you have asked, why haven't we heard about the wood stove yet? Well, we haven't, we hadn't got there yet, but we're getting there now. Um, so this whole area is gonna be bricked and you see I've already got some done here. And uh, so yeah, that's what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna get this all bricked here. So let's do it. dad's cutting stuff and like I'm helping him I take this and I like like that and put mortar on it and I just gonna wipe it on these bricks guys so I got the second side to my bricked fireplace done these are real clay bricks so they can withstand heat um, I'm gonna put the link for these in the video description I got these on Amazon and they're relatively inexpensive for a box of them and they look really cool I mean they're pretty much the real thing they're just small so I'm excited what to see what this is gonna look like when it's all done All right, I got the base done here for where the wood stove will sit. Now I've got one more thing to do and that's all the way up here. And as we've mentioned before in other videos, these two vents right here are gonna, we're gonna have a, a fan hooked to that so it will draw the heat that builds up up here, it'll draw it and circulate it throughout the bus. just finished putting the last piece of brick on for our fireplace area. I've also got the um, quartz piece installed and I bricked inside our little wood box here and so this little box what it's for is for putting scrap pieces of wood for burning in our fireplace. It's a little extra place to store stuff and it really turned out <laughs> really nice um, so the only thing I have left to do on it is grouting in between all the gaps and I know a lot of people might think oh my gosh it's got to weigh a lot there's got to be a lot of weight in there and um, but really the, it's it's really not too bad um, they're clay bricks they're actually real bricks like that and they're pretty thin and they're they're really quite light they're very inexpensive I use two boxes on all the brick I did. There was quite a bit of waste because of the way I had to cut the bricks in keeping a pattern. Um, 
And what I did is when I cut a brick, rather than just leaving the line nice and smooth and straight, I kind of gnarled the edges of it with the saw, just kind of took the saw and gnarled the edges of it just to give it still that rough look so they still look like complete bricks and you really can't tell one side from the other which side was cut with the saw and which side was not and it really uh, it looks nice we're happy with it so Isaiah is getting the bathroom all cleaned out and ready for us to grout the floors in there so we're actually hoping to be moved in here in a week. What are you working on? Uh, toe kick. Julie's getting all the toe kick done. So the vent that's under this cabinet here actually is attached to the vent that's up front at the top of our fireplace area that's gonna draw in warm air and send it back here and hopefully circulate it throughout the entire bus. It's just a theory, so we're gonna see if it works. All right, guys, we are back out here today, and what I'm starting to work on right now is our is grouting all of this. So this is not a chimney. I just want to make it clear. It's not a chimney. Um, I did put hardy backer behind this. I had some people saying you shouldn't have done that on wood. I didn't. There's hardy backer behind that, and then it's mortared in place, and now I'm going to grout in between these cracks. It's not a chimney. It's designed to kind of look like a chimney because our wood stove is going to be sitting right here and there's going to be a, a pipe that comes up and goes out the roof there. So I hope that clarifies it for some of you guys. Um, I'm going to try to put this grout down in such a way that it doesn't make a big mess. I'm not going to just smear it all on there. At least I don't think I'm going to do that. Maybe that'd be easier. I don't know. Maybe easier to smear it all on and then wipe it off. What I was doing is this. Okay, so the way I was doing this is I was pouring a little bit, I mixed up some grout. I was pouring a little bit of grout on here, like so. And I was taking this little, this little trowel and I was kind of just scooping the amount I wanted into it and kind of pressing it down. But you know what, I'm gonna try an area and just put it on and see what happens. So another rainy day in Orlando, Florida. This is kind of how it is every day. Usually every day at some point in the day it rains. And it usually means we have to work, you know, move our work to the inside of the bus. But we are kind of in the last leg of this bus conversion. Um, Julie's cutting out the, uh, the hinges and some of the last doors that we have to install. We don't have all the doors built, but we're going to install what we have and then finish up on the doors later. What? Another week or so? And... Yeah, we plan to be moved into the new bus in hopefully less than a week. Yep. We'll see how all that works out. And Arwen and Kira are at a birthday at party. At a birthday party. Swimming. Well, probably not swimming right now. It's Hanging out with other kids. Yeah. <laughs> Many people think that homeschooled kids don't hang out with other kids. It couldn't be further from the truth. how you want your texture to look something like that not too runny and not too thick so the weather has actually really slowed us down there's been times we'll pull everything out the weather will show no rain and literally 
30 minutes later it'll be pouring and we're rushing to get everything back in the bus so it's definitely it's definitely slowed things down here and there so I am putting on the last bit of route so I've got everything on my stove platform here grouted except for just this last area here so I'm gonna go ahead and do that so this is great. I love to play with Kira. Love to play with, and where is Kira right now? Uh, at a party. At a party? Yeah. yeah. And what's it doing outside right now? Uh, it's raining. Yeah, it's raining really hard, isn't it? So I want to work with Daddy right now. He was trying that he wrote we dumbest work and I. We got lots of work to do. But we're getting close to being done, aren't we? Yeah. Yeah. He's getting close. Very close. So let's get the rest of this grout done. Yes. Yes. All right guys, so all of the grout is done on our chimney and chimney base. It's not really a chimney, it just looks like a chimney. So it looks really good. So this is hanging up her head and we hear on her nose and her eyes, her and then her hand, her fingers, and her neck and her arms. So do you want to see my friends? So this is my bed and this. Viewers, they look attracted. Let's go. Wow, look at this room. Almost all the doors are up. Check this out. Ooh.